Welcome back to my channel, This Week NG TV. Click on the subscription button and don't forget to turn on the notification bell so that you'll be getting my updates each time it drops. And also, don't forget to like my videos. Thank you so much. I had, I made a broker to the state. And I told the state, look, we are not going to relent because we have been spending a lot of money on insecurity. Are you bunkering? Which is affecting our revenue in at the federal level. And we had meeting with security agencies and I told them you must go all out, all out. If I hear anybody who has been meeting, whether in a restaurant, whether in a hotel, and I find out that the curtains are there, we will invade that place. I will not give anybody any breathing space to organize yourself to attack. I will not agree. Two, if I hear anything of any filling station involved in oil bunkering, I will close that filling station. And therefore, I have directed the security agencies to know who has that filling station in Job and arrest that person and we are going to prosecute the person. It doesn't matter how highly that, place, that person is. Some of you should be used to be taught a lesson. It's not to go on radio. Time has come. We cannot allow oil bunkering. We can't. We will reduce this to the various uh, minimum. So I have ordered the security agencies to identify who owned that filling station that was sealed up two days ago and go after and arrest the owner of that filling uh, station. Let them tell us why he's involved in oil bunkering. So nobody can make the state to look unsafe. No, we won't allow it. We are spending money, paying security every day. Whether you are in PDP, whether you are in APC, whichever party you belong. When once we catch you, you are involved, to help. You can go to social media, write whatever you want to write. It's not my business. You can claim, oh, this and this, it's not my business. My business is to fight crime and criminalities. I owe nobody any apology to fight crime. I took out of office to say I'll protect life and uh, property. I took out of office. So until May 29, 2020, I'll continue to do that. So if you know there are criminals coming around your area and you give them a covering uh, space, no problem. But one day, we'll get intel and we'll know and when we come, you can tell people it's because they are not supporting me. What are they supporting me for? I'm not running any election. I'm not running any election, so you don't need to support me. If anybody fights our system, we will fight the person back. Let me tell you what you don't understand in politics. The moment you claim to be working with us, and tomorrow, you shift our enemy. We will take every might we have. We will even leave our enemy and finish you first. We will leave our enemy and finish you first. So all of you who are going back to Abuja to hold meeting with our enemies in this state, I'm going to finish you to the last. We can make the world we can. We can make the world we can. You can't come here, get from the state, be a contractor, get money, then you move to Abuja to hold meeting against us. And you say I will leave you free, I will not leave you free. I will not. I'm not a born again to this level. Yes, I'm a Christian, but I'm not a born again to this uh, level. If you touch me or touch any of my person, you will see the firework. So, I need that one saying this now. 
so that nobody should come and meet you and say, go and talk to me. Better talk to them now. Thank you.